I said, I was glad that's over. The brothers are piling in here too fast for me. They certainly has done and cleaned us out. We ain't got nothing left. You know, when the king said say that he was going to make an announcement down at the Lord's Hall about it, I thought maybe one or two of the members would come down here, but it seemed like every member in the Lodge was down here to me. When I give the brothers the money, you got them all to sign those notes, didn't you? Oh, yeah, I got all the notes right here now. Here's the notes. The Kingfish say that we can make a lot of money doing this, and if we work this thing right, I believe we can get rich. The only thing I was worried about, though, Andy, I wonder if the brothers is going to pay us back what they have done for us. Certainly they're going to pay us back. They got to pay us back. You got the notes there, ain't you? Let me look at the notes once here and check check up on your kind of. Uh, th- these are the notes that the kingfish brought down here. Here it is, right here. Now, I say here on the notes, uh, after days, I promise to pay to the order of... Wait a minute, how many days is that? Well, the kingfish say that I was supposed to write 30 days in there and make these here 30 days notes, you see. He's already got the eye in there, I promise. He done put the eye in itself. Mm-hmm. After 30 days, I promise to pay to the order of the High Finance Loan Company. And this brother here has got $5. Yeah, that's the last one that you let have any money. You see, he took the last five we had. $5. This year one is signed by George H-A-A-S. George has. Now, he is going to pay us $5 in 30 days. Now, you see up here, it says 50% interest. Oh, he pays 50% interest, huh? Yeah, uh, the, the king fee say that we can charge all the brothers 50% interest on anything we let them have. Let me see who signed some of these notes here. Uh, here's a whole bunch of them here. Here's one, George Junkin, $10. Tom Gooch. $25. How come your brother Gooch get away with $25? Well, he come up and asked me for $25, and I had it laying right here in front of me, so I let him have it. But that's all right, just so it pays us back. That's the main thing. You know, we ain't gonna make no money running this here loan company if we don't get the money back. What is this thing here? Oh, yeah, you see, this, this note here, when I asked this brother to sign his name, he said that he couldn't write, so I just got him to make an X down there. That's an X. Well, how you know who the brother is? That is right in it. You do the craziest things I done ever heard of. Instead of letting the brother sign the note and getting him to put his name on there, you get him to make an X on the bottom of it. Well, I remember once that, uh, that a fella down home had to sign something, and he couldn't write his name, and the lawyer had him put an X on there, you see? Well, what good is that going to do us? We don't even know who the brother is that made the X. Look at that. He got $10, too. Now, we done lost that. i tell you what we might do. We might uh, get the king's face to make an announcement at a meeting down the lodge and ask the brother to sign the X on his note there to give us his name. We ain't got no chance to find out who that is. He ain't going to tell us. You know, in the first place, I don't like the idea of lending everybody money like this. Even if we is running a loan company. Listen now, Amos. We had five hundred dollars. And don't forget the Kingfish bought fifty dollars itself, too. Don't forget that. Well, that left us four hundred and fifty dollars. I had the money sewed up in my coat, and it wasn't doing us no good there. And if we don't lend it out and charge interest on it, the money ain't gonna do us no good. I know, but the main thing is getting it back. It's done gone now. In 30 days, according to these notes, these brothers have got to pay us. Well, suppose they don't pay us, though. Then we'll have them put in jail. That's what we'll do. What good is that going to do us? Wait a minute now. Let me write something down here. Wait a minute. The thing that gets me, how come you think of all this stuff now? When the Kingfish told us about opening up the loan company, you said it was all right yourself. I don't know. I just happen to think, though, if the brothers don't pay us back, we is going to be in a mess. Well, let's figure here. See how much money we get out of this after the brothers pay us back. Now, say that they owes us $500. Yeah, that's what we lent out, $500. Now, we is charging 50% interest, ain't we? Explain to me, what does this your interest mean? What does that word interest? 
You don't mean to tell me that you don't know what interest means. Now, I hear a lot of people say interest. What do that mean, though? It say here on the note, you see, 50% interest. Well, that means that, uh, let me see. That means that the brothers that borrow the money, they take an interest in what they're doing, you see. I wonder if they're going to take an interest in paying us back. Uh, there ain't nothing like that on the note here. Oh, yeah, that interest there, that, that covers going and coming. They've got to do that. Well, go ahead, figure up how much profit is they going to make. Give me a piece of paper here. Yeah, 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 here's a piece of paper. Use one of these here notes here, right on the back of that. Now, let me see. This here brother here, let's figure on this brother. His name is D-O-N, Don, S-E-A-R-L-E, Searle, Don Searle. Uh, he done borrowed $10. Now, how much profit do we get back? We get 50%. Well, figure that out and see how much it is. Well, the first thing I put down now is $10. That's right. That's what he bought, $10. Now, then, I write that down, $10. Mm -hmm. Now comes the percent. Yeah, that's 50% that is now. Now, let's see. Uh, how many percent in a hole? What kind of hole? You mean a hole like a hole in the ground? No, no, wait a minute. 100% now, 100%. That's uh, perfect. What's perfect? 100% is perfect. Well, then, uh, 50%, then that's half puff again. That's right, that's half, see? Mm -hmm. 50% is a half. Now, then, he borrowed $10, and he pays us back half. $10, he pays us half. $10, and he pays us half. That don't sound good, do it? Half of 10 is 5. He pays us. And we is done giving 10. We give him ten, and he give us back five. Something is wrong here. According to that, then, we lose half of the money, don't we? Wait a minute now, wait a minute. Fifty percent is half. Half of ten is five. We give him ten, and he give us five. <laughs> we lose money on that. This your thing ain't working right. Half of ten is five. We is done give him ten, and he gonna give us back five. I's regusted. Wait a minute now, don't get regusted. Let's figure this here thing here. We give him ten dollars. Mm -hmm. Fifty percent of it is uh, half of it. Half of ten is five. I know I's regusted. Uh huh. Answer that telephone, Amos. Wait, that wait a telephone. minute, I answer. Go ahead. Hello. What's that? This here is the high finance loan company. Uh oh. What's that? Can't hear you. Oh, you was one of the large members, huh? You want to borrow some money from the high finance loan company? Tell them the high finance loan company's got to borrow some themselves. He don't. Hello. Hello. Andrew Brown told me to tell you that the high finance loan company has got to borrow some money themselves to eat on. Hang up. I've got I said, I said, the high finance loan company has got to borrow some money so they can eat. Can you hear me? Hello. I say the high finance loan company ain't got no money.